Hi guys, it's Mark Smith, uh, Cropodist at We Fix You, just showing you a quick lesson on how to properly put on and take off a mask. Um, so when you grab a mask, it doesn't matter what style it is, whether it's a elastic ear loop uh, medical mask or a homemade mask with ties around the head, it's the same, the same protocol for everything. So minimize the touching of the front of the mask, that's kind of the key lesson here. Um, your hands are always dirty, always assume you're carrying some sort of pathogen on your hands. Uh, first, wash your hands. Go to the sink, do your 20 second hand wash, dry your hands, come back, pick up the mask by the elastic bands or the straps. When you put it over your face, get it about halfway up your nose, use the tension in your hands to pull it over your chin, get it around your ears. The only time you want to touch the front of your mask with clean hands is when you squeeze it down tight around your nose and give a final adjustment to make sure it's over your chin. So you should have a good seal across here, down the sides and around the bottom. Now do not touch your mask while you have it on. If you do, wash your hands. Um, don't touch your eyes, don't touch anything like that, all the common sense type of stuff. Leave it on as long as you can, as long as it doesn't get soiled or wet. When you take off your mask, it's pretty much the opposite. Wash your hands. Get it from the ear loops, pull it straight off. Now different colleges for different practitioners will have different regulations. For chiropodists, as long as it's not wet or soiled in any way, we are allowed to reuse this mask for the rest of the day. So we can take it off, put it somewhere, uh, like a brown paper bag kind of thing that's, that's kind of rolled up so it can't get dirty, uh, and go have lunch kind of thing. And then do the same thing after lunch to put it on. Uh, most of the time with a mask though, especially this type, you want to dispose of it with your cloth type. You do want to throw that right in the laundry and, uh, and, and have it ready for next time. Okay.